It was the murder of a young boy in Cherokee Park that rocked Kentuckiana in 2014. That case returns to court this week. Thanks for staying with us at 430. The suspect, Joseph Cameron, charged with killing 12-year-old Ray Etheridge. The I-team's Derek Rose with surveillance video were seen for the first time in other details about this case so troubling. It really is, Rachel. You know, this uh, video was one of the clues that police said at the time was very critical to their case and helped them solve the case. A surveillance video that shows 21 year old Joseph Cameron with the 12 year old Ray Etheridge. It could be the last images of the young boy before he was killed. It's the first time we're able to see what could be the last recorded images of Ray Etheridge alive. Surveillance video from the Mid City Mall shows the 12 year old boy walking side by side with 21 year old Joseph Cameron. There's no audio on the recording, so it's unclear what the two are discussing, but there does not appear as though there's any animosity. In fact, according to police, the two knew each other from time spent in and around Cherokee Park. Both police told us were homeless and Cameron had a camp set up at the park. Police tell us the Mid City Mall surveillance video is what led them to Cameron. Etheridge and his mother had gone to the mall, but the 12 year old wandered off and somehow ended up walking with Cameron. The video shows the two walking outside. Cameron appears to light a cigarette before the two walk out of frame. The timeline between them leaving the mall and the murder is unclear, but Cameron, when talking to detectives, left no question as to how the little boy died. Next thing I remember, the knife is in his chest and my hand is shaking and I pulled it out. <coughs> Did he say anything? He said he was sorry and to let him go. Cameron is scheduled to return to court tomorrow for a pretrial hearing, and we just learned from prosecutors within the last 15 minutes. Rachel, this case is scheduled to go to trial in April 2019. I'm Derek Rose, WHAS 11 News.